7 a.m. Already at it. The a.m. darkness, though. Gone with the s'mores quest this morning. 333 grams of russet potato with 96 grams of fat-free Greek yogurt acting as sour cream and 192 grams of lean chicken breast seasoned with Montreal seasoning, the chicken kind, Cholula hot sauce on top, salt and pepper, the goat. So I just went to the mail room to pick up a package. It turns out it's from Enlightened. So I posted about their ice cream on Instagram and they sent me out a package of these snacks. Look pretty solid. I guess I'll try them out in the future and either make an Instagram post about them or review them here. I do recommend their ice cream. Not sure about these yet because I haven't tried them, but I will be doing that soon. So. Stay tuned for that, and thank you, Enlightened. All right, guys, bags are packed. Backpack is downstairs. Bed is made, or at least semi-made. Looks like we're good to roll out. Packed up, just walking to my car right now. I'm gonna drive home. It's about an hour and a half drive, and I plan to train arms and hit some cardio, and then just chill for a little, maybe have some whey. And then we're going to head out to sushi later on tonight. So we'll have to see what time it is when I get done training arms. Probably be decently late by the time I drive home and do all that. But really nice day, as you see. Super sunny once again. Zero clouds. So definitely a little surprised that it's this nice. But can't complain about that. So let's get on the road. Hydration essentials, you know, it's funny. I don't even get monster that much But I feel like whenever I do get monster for some reason it happens to be in a video But this pineapple coconut is what I'd rather aware you of This seltzer water right here big win is the brand 10 out of 10 taste Crater though, yard is getting redone. Pretty serious hole. All right, guys, gonna get some food, some more food, and hit arms. Let's do it. And we're back. Fuck those leaves. Damn. Pretty cold. Gym time.
Come on, Riley. Chest day. Yeah, you can lay down. Lay down. It's okay. You don't have to get up. Aw, oh, I made him get up. Lay down. You want the halo? What up, guys? Sunday night right now, about 8.40 p.m., and I'm at home this weekend, as you see by the looks of the gym, so definitely really uh, good to lift at home because, as I've said in the past, I enjoy lifting at home much, much more than I do enjoy lifting at school. But with that uh, behind us, I did get 225 on the incline for 10 reps, which for me is matching my last session of a PR. However, I do consider it a tad of a PR because this last rep, although very grindy, was a lot less grindy than the last time I got 10 reps, which was my last session. Also, I consider it a PR because my knee is unfortunately, very, very unfortunately giving me problems right now. I tried to squat yesterday and uh, I was really bummed out when I when I felt a sharper pain in my left knee. I was I was super bummed and I I pretty much just stayed in the gym for calves and cardio and hamstrings because that's all I could do. I didn't want to push it. But needless to say, um, obviously, if loading my quadriceps is putting tension on the knee, then I'm not going to be able to use any leg drive on my pressing. So basically, that pressing you saw, I was not using really my normal form, I guess you could say. I was kind of more so isolating. So uh, for those factors, for those reasons, I do consider it a pretty solid PR. But uh, as for the knee, I'm, I'm really hoping that it's minor, and I do think it is. I'm knocking on wood here. Um, it feels minor, I'm not going to lie. It feels like something that I just tweaked a little bit, you know, it may be some loose cartilage or something. But all in all, I'm feeling super strong. And I'm probably just going to continue to make some improvements, maybe do a little mini cut, and then we'll see what happens. But I hope you enjoy the rest of the video. Running out of time here on this voiceover, so I'll catch you guys in the next one. Until then, peace out, guys. New Quest Bar flavor, Rocky Road. Honest review going down right now. Literally one of the best ones, if not the best, to be honest. The chunk quality there, as you see, is really, really pronounced. Tons of chunks. Definitely would recommend the Rocky Road Quest Bar. Better than the new blueberry, better than the new oatmeal chocolate chip. It's right up there with cookie dough, cookies and cream, double chocolate chunk, s'mores. Probably even a little better. Munching on seven cheddar rice cakes while Rich Piana munches on some fresh kitchen, goddammit. Nice to see that Piana's back in the game in his new house. The with a new girl. Coconut, what is it? Coconut what? Coconut Check ginger. it out. Coconut ginger. Here come the gains. I got, ooh, that's hot. Super hot. Pack of basmati rice, 160 grams of chicken, and broccoli cauliflower carrots mixture. Super hot in my hand. But I'm basically just going to throw the sugar-free ketchup around here and dig in. Perfect meal right here. Carbon up.